Okay, folks, we're back. For me, it was instantaneous. For you, it took a day. But we are in Chateau LeBlanc. And... We just, uh... Found a dud sphere in the room over there. And then we fought Wormy and... The other guy, whatever his name is. And, uh, now we're gonna see where that... Where they've hidden the real sphere. So, again... I've mentioned this last episode. I'll mention it again. And that is the fact that I'm recording this for the second time, because the previous recording of this one got screwed up when I originally recorded it. And, um, I moved on, and the, for some reason the third one turned out perfect and didn't screw up. So I'm re-recording these two, and you're gonna notice that when you get to the third recording, I mean the third, yeah, the third episode of these, so when we get to part 34, I think it is or is it 35 or 36 I don't know when we get to the next part you're gonna notice that my uh, equipment is gonna be slightly off and you're gonna wonder why not equipment just the stats and money is probably gonna be a little off that's all so whatever it's all good but we are still in Chateau LeBlanc and basically we're here this is part of the main store we stole syndicate uniforms and now we're here to try to get back that sphere that LeBlanc and gang stole from us on our earship a little while ago. Okay, so you come down here, you're gonna notice these little latches on the ground. You wanna make sure you press them. So that'd be one. Okay. And then you wanna drop down in the next area, and there's another one here. Oops. There you go. And now we're gonna head all the way across and we're gonna get spikes chasing us. Yay! Ah! Now, what's your normal reaction for this, folks? Your normal reaction is spikes. Oh my god, we're all gonna die. You know what my reaction is? Ah! I know, you're like, why are you standing there? You're actually supposed to do that. Which, how would you ever figure out you're supposed to get hit by the spikes? It's ridiculous. <laughs> Initiate the cutscene, it takes you here. And now we, um, activate the override or whatever that does. And now we can head back to that spike area and proceed through that wall. Isn't that cool, folks? Do 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 do. Got to jump, jump, jump. This enemy encounter always found funny, the worms, like, what the hell are those things supposed to be like? Some kind of machina or something? I kind of miss the Final Fantasy X enemies. But hey, the battle, again, the battle engine in this game is really not that bad. I mean, um, I, can, I make the argument, I've made it before, I'll make it again. I actually like the battle engine in this game more than Final Fantasy X, the original. I just... The story sometimes really bothers me, that's all, in this particular game. Just because of all the side quest garbage. Yay! More battles. Because we have no escape. No escape. No escape. Yes, you learned Kiraga, even though in my uh, next file I've already learned it. As a matter of fact, talking in future tense, guys, I think on my next episode, um, Pain finally masters her warrior tree. All of it. <laughs> uh, I couldn't help it. I just find it funny talking about something that you haven't seen yet. Alright. Everyone's healed, we're good to go, let's head in. It's gotta be in here, right? Let's split up and look. Maybe in that obscure treasure chest right over there? Found it! Found it. It did. Huh? No, Riku found it first, you jerk. 
I was wondering why they'd bother stealing half a broken sphere. Of course! They already had the other half! Yeah, I find that kind of weird with that treasure chest. I don't think it's accessible, because... I went through a lot of trouble gathering those them. pieces, all for no G uh, Then we go straight to back to the airship. So don't you lay a finger on it. Let's get them, boys. Yeah, yeah baby. Boss. All right, and this encounter could actually be a little bit challenging because of LeBlanc and her annoying status ailment garbage. But we're gonna do our best. Time to clap it We're gonna start off by taking uh, one of them out at a time. So we're gonna make sure we want to power break and do all that good stuff. For me, want to cast protect and shell with uh, Riku. With the obvious right. reason That's being that uh, these guys can hit like a freaking truck sometimes. Time to turn up the heat. Uh oh. <laughs> Kill him! He's immune? Oh, I didn't realize that. Practice. What practice? <laughs> That's pretty cool, actually. You know, I didn't realize that, but or me, whatever, the fat guy is immune to Yuna's bullets on her gun. That's kind of cool. Oh, crap. He's gonna hurt. Ooh, that did hurt. Heart is such sweet sorrow. On. Once we kill one of them, it gets a lot easier. Let's do a little, uh, Kiraga. Ow! Yuna, hang in there! We, we're almost done! You got this, Yuna! Party is such sweet sorrow. Ah! Oh, now I hit him. That's weird. He was immune to it last time. Strange. Need to get him out of this battle. So as you can see, this, the, it, as I said before, this is taking a little, a little while longer than normal. And again, the reason for that is because it, it gets a lot harder with all three of these characters. There you go, that's one down, two to go. It was not Magic. Really. Power break on him. Go trigger happy. And he silenced pain. That's not what I wanted. Armor break. One thing I have to do with my white mage, eventually when Rev is my white mage, or if I decide to have a white mage, you know, in the end, is I really, like, let's say Riku ends up being a permanent white mage, I really have to make sure she has some kind of off of offensive spells too, because right now, you know what I need to do? Oh wait, I don't have the dispel spell yet, so I can't do that. Okay, it's just down uh, LeBlanc now. Shouldn't be too bad. Goodbye, LeBlanc. I'm gonna kick your ass now. How about a little armor break on you? Ow. I hate this battle. <laughs> I, I just don't like it. Table turner. Try a little Excalibur. See if that crushes her. I want to see if she's affected by Excalibur. Since it's one of Pain's most powerful abilities. Yeah, 398. That's not bad. And she's dead. We are victorious, people. You can silence me all you want. But I always get the last laugh. Want another helping of your just desserts? <gasps> no one's gonna hear you scream from down here. 
Wait a second. I'll let you see what's in the sphere. Let us? Please, the sphere is yours to watch. Let's check out the sphere. Mission complete, yay! Not bad. Let's hope it doesn't gl glitch out here. Some reason when I switch to AMVs, it really messes things up. Like, here we go, it switched to AMV already on my... There. Do not mess up. Is that Vegna gun? That looks pretty badass, but I still think Sin looks cooler. I'm sorry, Vegna Gun, but Sin is cooler than you. You fail. I ain't worried about that. Police, we that got is this. the Colossus, Vegna Gun. We finished there ain't our no way we don't got this. It appears to have been recorded underneath Bavel. I see Bavel hasn't lost its old fondness for secrets. Exactly. Those Yevon scum have been concealing that weapon all along. If anyone uses that thing, Spira is done for. But it's a Machina! All we have to do is shake, and shake our way up to it and take it apart. That's what Nucci's got in mind. And of course, whatever he's planning is what I'm planning. Well, whatever what you're planning you? is what I'm planning. Me? The summoner who defeated Sin ought to stand up and defend Spira again. This is true. Hmm. So, then I guess we're on the same side. We'll be waiting for you. <laughs> waiting where? Over here. Don't be silly, love. On your airship, of course. I've always wanted to take a spin on that thing. Who invited you onto our airship? <laughs> LeBlanc's kind of funny. See that treasure chest? It's not opened. Sin is gone. The calm is here. I thought our peaceful days would Yay, never end. An emotional seed, the finally. eternal calm. I really believed it would last forever. It's okay, you know. Until now. Kind of a. I realized how fragile it th can be. This is where the game has potential to be good when they have scenes like this, but they don't use it enough. Ah, it bothers me. It really does. Okay, and folks, this is we're all caught up. Now, I would extend this episode a little longer, but I already have my next episode recorded, and it continues from where this is. So, without further ado, I say to you, thank you for watching. I love you. I love you. We'll see you next time for more Final Fantasy X-2. Goodbye.